Recently, there have been serious agitations by some parts of the country as a result of alleged marginalization and injustice. The most alarming is the agitations by some groups in the Southeast who are conversing for the establishment of the sovereign state of Biafra. Most disturbing is the demands by some northern groups that Igbos living in the north should leave before October. It's against this backdrop and as a matter of urgency that the organized labor whose members most times are the worst hit in times of conflict deemed it fit to make its position known on this disturbing development. Addressing journalists on the ongoing drumbeat of war, the president of Nigerian Labor Congress, Comrade Ayuba Mwaba, and his trade union congress counterpart, Comrade Boboy Kaigama, stated that the unity and sovereignty of Nigeria cannot be compromised and it is not negotiable. Those persistent hot exchanges and attacks tend to threaten, threaten the very foundation and integrity of our sovereignty and unity and therefore do not represent the true feeling of patriotic Nigerians for one another. Rather, they symbolizes the intensity of greed, the implicability, arrogance and desperation of the elites, some of whom have been funding or sponsoring the hate campaign that can only lead to disintegration of our dear nation. Let's look at those good aspects and see how we can implement them. And let's not continue to throw blends because some of us strongly believe that soon after the conference there are certain administrative things that should have been implemented almost immediately. Also speaking of education, human rights activist Femi Falana cautions Nigerians to look at what binds them together as a nation rather than those that divide them. Those who want implementation of the recommendations should be prepared for a struggle with labor and with the progressive extension of the civil society. They also stress that most of the issues in contention can be addressed through good governance sustainable and transparent fights against corruption and promotion of equity and injustice in the system. Ekaiti Boots, ITV News, Abuja.